Okay, hello guys, so this is the Redmi Magic 7 and this video I will show you how to unlock the bot response and also the response you know, this Okay, we are going to use the fast boot method because in some recovery is not available for this one. Okay, you can use this method for any person, for the European person or the North American person. Okay, I will provide all the link and the steps in the description box on my blog. Okay, so stay tuned and check it out. Okay, hello guys, Assalamualaikum. We met again with Ombop. Okay, this time we have a uh, GTA pawn. This is the GTA uh, Red Magic 7. Okay, in the Nubia version. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, Nubia is now separated from GTA. And today we're going to try to read this pawn. Uh, using a patch boot method okay uh the first thing i want to told you that this pawn is still new and it still doesn't have a custom recovery okay so i'll show you how to unlock put load respawn and then let's flash the pets boot image and how to get the boot image from the from your update okay mm. Okay, first thing to do, like usual, let's check the specs. Uh, okay, let's go to the about pawn right here. The model name for the that let me eh, sorry let me. Uh, <laughs> the Red Magic Seven. Mm -hmm. The code name is an X six seven nine G. Yeah, using the Red Magic OS version five and it's using the version 4.12 <clears throat> and it used the eu eu common region okay eu it's mean european and it has two version okay the european and the uh, north american and asian okay it has 12 gig of ram and 128 gigs of internal storage okay the first thing you want to do is, like usual, enable the developer option. Okay, just select the build number five times. Then, okay, where is it? Select the build number five times, and it it will open the YMN unlock. Okay, just enable it and go back. Okay, make sure you have removed all the emails. Uh, we will get locked if you forget to remove the emails. Okay. Okay, let's check the specs using the Ada64. <clears throat> it's using the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1. 4 nanometer. Okay. Go back. Okay, it's Nubia. Platform is Taro and product name is MX six seven nine G European Union version. Okay, let's go back. <clears throat> and because we want to use a uh, patch boot method, the first thing you want to do is install the uh, manager in this one. Okay, I already have copied the file. I will provide the link for the, all the files and steps. Okay. In my blog the link is in the description box okay go to the pawn <clears throat> this is the latest images if not if i'm not mistaken we need this apk to patch the boot mg okay uh 24.3 this is the latest one when i'm making this video okay let's put this down <clears throat> and okay let's switch screen <clears throat> okay this is the step <clears throat> okay 
uh disclaimer okay routine will void warranty blah 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 and also might appear with fingerprint scanner and or trust zone the path okay the stock firmware is in here and you can always download the latest one okay okay download the latest one and update your uh, red magic okay for this now it's using the version for or one two okay the EU, european and a north america and asia okay the thing you want to do is download the firmware and you'll find the file like this one okay the size is about uh four gigabyte and if you open the file you can see something like this okay this is a payload it means that we need to end back the file Okay, download the ROM, step, unpack, get the boot EMG. <clears throat> okay, I'm using the CRV and with kitchen. As you can see, I already unpacked the ROM. Ah, it's great. Okay, I will show you. Just hit this button, create new project, and give it a name. Magic 7. Okay. Then copy the path where you have the files and open it in here and hit this one okay to extract the ROM. Okay, it will take some time, but I will cancel it because I already have back. Okay, you can see the progress right here. Blah blah blah. Okay, let's close this one and let's check the result <clears throat> uh where is it uh back repack okay this is the file that i have unpacked uh where is it i kind of forgot <laughs> uh output no oh, no source okay this one okay this is the source so uh, using the crb we will you need to unpack the zip file and we'll get this one okay just need the boot mg let's copy the file and put it in the no, storage let's connect the usb cable where is it uh, okay okay i hope you get the point copy the boot mg and place it in uh the storage <clears throat> Okay, let's paste in here. Okay, the size is about 98 megabyte. Okay, I will provide the original boot MG for the version 4.412. Okay, but if you're using another version or there will be newer version you can always get the boot emg okay because i already told you how to and let's switch the screen again <clears throat> now <clears throat> let's open the menus hit the install button right here select and patch a file okay it will go to the file manager and find your internal storage okay. and this is the boot image let's select the file okay, it let go and it will patch the file okay all done it said and it save in the storage emulated download magic blah 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 okay <clears throat> okay let's 
plug the USB cable again. Uh, we need to copy the file. And here we go. This is the OTMG that has already that has been already patched with magis. Let's copy it here. Okay, so I have two files: the original one and <coughs> the patch one. Okay, done and for the next steps is uh, we want to unlock the device okay so you already make sure you already enable the OM unlock okay in the developer option then let's go to the bootloader okay i'll show you okay the previous the Review steps. Okay, I already show you. <clears throat> then setting developer option. Okay, need to enable this one. Okay, and then let's go to the bootloader mode. As usual, you can use the adb command or turn off the pawn. <clears throat> and let's go to the bootloader by pressing the volume down and the power button. we go pull them down and power button okay you will see the screen and then plug your usb cable again then we need to unlock the pawn using the command line that's switch again open the uh, terminal okay and let's unlock the pawn okay it simply just use the fastboot command okay just type fastboot space flashing space unlock and you will get notification on the pawn <coughs> uh, by unlocking blah 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 okay it will void your guarantee don't forget okay just volume down to select the menu Okay, from up, from down, select the unlock the bootloader and press the uh, power button. Okay, it will unlock the pawn and usually format the data. <clears throat> okay, let's wait. Now it's formatting the internal storage okay make sure <clears throat> you already back up all the importing files in your pawn uh, because the bootloader will always uh, erase the internal storage okay you can wait until it goes to the home screen or simply you can force the pawn to reboot again to the bootloader Okay, I think I will wait until it goes to the home screen. And here we go. Now it's entering the home screen and you have to scroll down. <laughs> okay, read the policy. The language as usual. Uh, let's set up offline. Okay, here we go. Now we are on the home screen and we have unlocked the other pawn. So we need to go to the bootloader again. Okay, let's turn off the pawn, power it off, and it goes to the bootloader. Pressing from down and power button. Okay. 
And let's see the screen again. And for the next step is we need to flash the modifier with EMG. Okay, so open the CMD. Let's copy this one. And okay, let's select the modify boot mg okay hit enter and let's reboot again into the end rate okay let's check if there is already mages okay you can see right here we have mages but it is incomplete okay so let's open it and it will operate and download the necessary files okay you can always uh okay just give it permission settings allow from the source update okay go back and here we go now we have a working root access using my in the in our uh that magic okay for the first time it's usually asking for update just hit okay it will reboot in five seconds and now we already have a working magic okay i have installed the root beer root checker and safety net okay let's open the root checker just for fun verify root and it will ask for permission just grant it okay congratulations your access is properly installed on blah 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 okay <clears throat> on our red at magic 7. okay if you want to use magis you need to hide some apps okay i will show you there is a special video for this but i will show you anyway okay let's go to the settings <clears throat> and enable the Zygis and for Stanilis okay configure the analysis and make sure you have checked all the apps that you want to hide such as the root beer and okay maybe safety net okay let's check it out <clears throat> so it won't read the root access okay if you have Something like this is still read the subinary. You must restart the pawn. Okay, after enabling the Zygis. Okay, and for the safety net, if the pawn doesn't pass the safety net, you need to flash magis module. Okay, I'll show you. Go to the magis and go to the module, install pawn storage, <clears throat> and install the safety net safety net fixed okay and reboot okay done and it's always a good idea to rename the magic file okay so go to the settings and hide the magic apps change the name to whatever you want it like bob maybe uh maybe abc okay it will <clears throat> Repack the package name. Okay. Okay, let's check it again using the root beer. <clears throat> okay, nice. So it doesn't read the root access. And let's check the safety net. Now it's passed. Okay, that's all, guys. <clears throat> I hope you like my video. If you like, please give it a thumb. Uh, and I also have a last video about custom ROM. You can check right here. And if you subscribe, it will make me excited to make a new video. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you, guys. I hope this video helps you. Stay safe, stay healthy, and wassalamualaikum.